Hey guys, what's going on? Spartan War 5 Gun here today. Bring you guys another Black Ops commentary. In today's video, I wanted to bring up this question, which is which do you find to be more game ruining? The actual game itself or the players that play it? Now, for me, uh, Call of Duty is one of those games that more or less it's the, you know, players that play it that ruin it for me, you know. It's not so much the, um, what you call it, the game itself. The game itself, for Call of Duty, and I mean, it runs pretty smooth overall. I mean, it, it's a more casual game than others, you know. It's not some Battlefield, Ghost Recon, or one more serious games. It's just one of those casual games that you can jump on, play, and have a good time with, you know. It's not meant to be this spectacular monument of gaming, you know, it's, it's just there, you know, and, I mean, they have a working engine right now, it's, you know, fully functional and everything, it's working, people enjoy it, for the most part, at least, you know, but, um, overall, I mean, the game itself is perfectly fine, it's the players, for me at least, that ruin it, because people overabused, overpowered weapons, they will just sit in corners all day and just make the game so slow, it's unbelievable. And overall, they just make it a... Sometimes, at least. Some lobbies will be a good time. Other lobbies, just people are just complete douchebags. Just like, oh my god, what are you doing? Oh my god. But, um... I mean, overall, Call of Duty is one of those games that the game itself isn't what really breaks it. But one game that I do what am I trying to think here? Sweet precious. But uh good God. But um one game that I really can think of that is, you know, more so the game breaks it than anything else is Battlefield 3. Now I'm not trying to jump on the whole hate Battlefield train because it's well, I mean, I guess it's pretty much empty right now, so I could be a trendsetter. I'm a hipster now. I joined the hate train before it was cool to do, but, um, what you call it, I mean, I feel as if after patch 1.04 with Battlefield, it just completely destroyed the game, it's not so much the players, the players are doing, you know, I can't believe they're actually still playing that game after what happened, so it's not so much the players that I'm pissed off about, it's the game itself, I mean, the mechanics... They're, eh, you know, I mean, the new engine, it's like, oh my god, so spectacular. But, I mean, realistically, I can't vault over things that you really could think you could vault over. You know, my weapons don't really work all that well. I'm running so many different combinations of attachments. It's unbelievable that I haven't been able to find one that's been able to give me success. And it's just, I can't stand it anymore, you know? That's the main reason why I don't like Battlefield. It's the first game that really, the game itself, is really what pisses me off more than anything else. Because Call of Duty, I mean, it's one of those games that the people just exploit it. Like in, let's say, Modern Warfare 2, for example. Infinity War didn't really realize that there was one-man army, danger close, grenade launchers, you know, that kind of exploit. You know, I mean, do they really think they just put it in there like, hey, let's just, you know, make a complete stupid, idiotic, like, uh, combination here and just throw that together? No, people found that out. It leaked on the internet, and then that's how the problem got a big issue, because it just got leaked to the community. But, um, other things. MP40 Juggernaut, you know? I mean, was that a combination they were really thinking would be... A dominant combination of World of War? No. I mean, people just found that out, started exploiting it, and became a problem. So, I mean, Call of Duty is one of those games that's just... The people who play it really make it bad, instead of the actual game itself. Now, are there some mechanics in the game that are bad? Yes, of course. I mean, every game's not perfect. There's always going to be flaws. But, I lost my train of thought here. Um, what was I going to say? Essentially, it's just the player. It's more so the players that make it bad than anything else. But that's just my personal opinion. I don't know what you guys think, so let me know in the comment section below what you think about what the topic of today's discussion was, and what do you think about the new intro and watermark I tried putting on here. I don't know if you guys like it or not, but um, I don't know. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna roll with it. See how it goes, and. Uh, just go from there. So, uh, if you guys enjoy the video, please leave a rating if you would like to. I'm not forcing you to because I'm not a 
YouTube Nazi. But uh, other than that, thank you guys for watching. Peace out. And this video is just about done, so I'll let the gameplay roll out. And have a great day. Spy plane standing by. Our spy plane's in the air. Got your spy plane up. They're blind. Friendly sentry gun on the way. Friendly care package inbound. Care package ready for delivery. Mark the DC. Friendly care package on the way. UE on the way. Remember this victory. We have displayed our power.